Okay, so guys, in this video, we are going to see how to load 1 lakh data into a React application, which means we have the map method, right? So where, where we are, uh, you know, uh, loop the data and we will bind the data in the UI. So let's see how we can, already we have an, uh, we did it on, uh, you know, on testing, like how we, how we can able to insert the MySQL. So now with the same implementation, I have created an API with our, uh, I have created a API with Express JSAC as you can see with the same query but only thing is now I wrapped this exact uh, you know the, the response by using the Express okay so now, now this API is running on the port number 8080 so as you can see here <coughs> okay so now this application is running on the port number 8080 okay so here what I am going to do I am going to I created one react application so already so now i am going to remove everything okay which is the default output of this react right okay so if you see this react output where is the browser yeah this is the one so now i have removed everything here i am going to call the api using the fetch method so it, the response will have a lot of objects but i am going to use only id and name actually okay fine so now html tag now okay fine yeah so now it is working fine sorry now we did it we did it the we did our react thing let me save the file and let me check our react is running okay okay it is i didn't import this state so let me import it why why this okay so guys uh, now my react application is working my api is also working actually okay so let me open the console so if you see here now I am trying to load the data. Now here what we are going to do, we are going to hit the API. But however, here I am returning all the result, right? Instead of returning all the result, I am going to add limit. So this limit will load from 0, 1000 records, okay? It will not load all the records because initially I want to know that whether my React can able to handle 1000 records or not, okay? Fine. So now my API is already restarted automatically. And uh, yes, so let me click on this button. This button will call my API, Express API. Let's see. Yes. So now as you can see here, my API is working fine for the 1000 data. So for the 1000 data as you can see here, which gives a proper response and also a little faster. Okay. So now I am going to add 50,000. Okay. So let's see how it works. So as usual, I need to refresh this page. Okay. Now click on this one. Let me check the response. Okay. The response came guys as you can see here. Uh, but that is not binded in the API. So even I think the problem is with the browser. So the browser is taking too much time to bind the response. But will it come to my thing? Yeah, as you can see here, 50,000 record came to my browser. Yeah. So as you can see here, it takes around uh, 17,923 milliseconds it took to process the 50,000 records. But however, it, it binded into my browser. As you can see, it is faster. But it takes some more time. Let's see how much minutes it takes actually. As you can see here, it took around uh, 1000, sorry, 30 seconds, okay, minutes actually. It is 30 seconds it takes to process the 50,000 records actually, okay, the React application in my system. I think it's based on uh, uh, system as well as the RAM size, guys, because the problem is if you see here, my API given which very faster. Only thing is the browser takes too much time to process the data okay now with this implementation i am going to uh, load with one lakh so one lakh data i don't want to add limit directly i will load it okay so select start from users let me save the file and now uh, let me refresh the page and i think uh, as we know 50000 it took around 30 seconds i think for one lakh i hope it may take around uh, once one minute okay 60 seconds i think which means one minute yeah so the response came as you can see here. I think the API is very faster, but the problem is the UI will take much time to load the data. Okay, so guys, the conclusion is, I think here after uh, the end user cannot wait. <laughs> so we can just conclude that React will not be able to store or maybe the browser cannot be able to store one lakh data a single shot no 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 it completed see it's complete <laughs> it's completed guys okay let me scroll I, i'm giving control end actually go to the end of the browser control end it will work right yeah okay so guys yes as you can see this is the last data one lakh 174 this is the last guy yes this is working but how much time it will take it will take to process this one if you see here 
let me try for two minute it takes around two minutes guys okay but i don't know for 50000 records it took only 20 seconds but why for 1 lakh record it takes this much time still i couldn't understand that's fine okay so guys i thought of uh, this is what we have to wait actually okay fine guys so the conclusion is react can able okay see one more thing uh, the react itself is very fast if i scroll means it loads very fastly so we cannot say anything with the react react is looking very faster only thing is maybe the initial time took um, process the initial time took for processing the data okay so it is fine guess but the problem is i think with the browser see browser is also loading fine good okay so guys yes react and the browser it takes time but however it loads the data now as you can see i can able to scroll it's not lagging also see i can able to scroll which is very faster okay fine the same scenario we will do with java as well and we will see how much time it takes to process the one lakh data for the response java with spring boot also we will do okay thank you